everybody. Welcome back. Um, I'm Jenna. This is Drew. And today um, we are going to be unboxing uh, a whole box of salt and pepper shakers. So let's see what we have. A lot of them I haven't ever seen even out in the wild. <laughs> out in the wild? What do you yep. mean by that? Like in stores and stuff. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. So the first thing we have is some ducks. Here we go. They are not marked. Here's the top of them. Salt and pepper. They do have their plugs, which is always nice. Here's their... At first I thought they would hug, but I don't think... Here's their little rumps. This one has just a small... Spot right there. Anyway, they're cute. I was trying to figure out how you would set them. Okay. Next, we have this is very interesting. So these say what fun, W A T T fun, or this one does on the top. They say, right light corporation. Oh, wait. Yeah, right light corporation, Clarendon, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. So that's on the side of it. And on the inside, they have pepper in it. Now, on the bottoms, they do have holes. Sure. But on the inside, they each have, one has a salt packet. packet and one has a pepper packet. So that's very interesting. Mm, how and, and they do open. So How would you tell if one's which one? Oh. And they, I don't know. I was thinking that they were glass, but now I'm not so sure. They sound like it. Yeah, they do sound like it. Well, anyway, that's very interesting. Oh, yes. Yeah. See, Drew fixed them. They hug. Yeah. yeah. That's the ducks I hug. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I, I love salt and pepper shakers that look like they're hugging. I don't know why, but this matches, I guess. Okay. These are interesting. That's what I'm going to say. They're interesting. It's Adam and Eve. And you can turn them and Eve has a little spot. So you get the drift. Uh, here's the back. The tag says made in Taiwan, Republic of China. So there's that. But here's the top of them. Adam and Eve, salt and pepper. We have we have some toes. This is a souvenir from Missouri. It says kicking around in Missouri. I guess it would go like this. Sorry, my y'all probably can't see that. But I cut myself yesterday when I was making supper, and it is burning really bad right now. Oh, maybe, I think it does go that way. I don't know. Anyway. They have faces on the bottom. Yes, on the bottom, they have these cute little faces. And then you, their toe, their toes have the... Uh, holes for the for, for the salt and pepper to come out and now they do not have their plugs and they sit like straight up and down it looks like oh you think they sit like this yeah you could sit them like this or you could sit them like this because you see how it's kind of like used on yeah. the bottom mm -hmm. so i'm guessing they sit yeah it does look like they do sit on the bottom okay Next, we have a two little churches. 
salt and pepper. Look at that, that is too cute. One has its plug, one does not. No uh, markings. And there's where they come out at, right there. The sides are just white and gold, very pretty. I like those a lot. Then we have, this is interesting, it does say Japan on the bottom. They have signatures on And them. they are, this says New Orleans, Louisiana. So it is crab claws. Right crab or lobster, probably lobster because of the color. Um, salt and pepper souvenirs from New Orleans. Very cute. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that before. Next, we have these are glass squirt salt and pepper bottles. Salids. It says Mexico on the bottom. And then it has a little logo for squirt. Well, that, those are cute. But they do not have signatures to see which one's salt or pepper. Right. They're like, they look the same. Then we have drip drop. So I guess these are raindrops. Red raindrops. Yep, yep. <laughs> one has its plug and the other one doesn't. The back, they have faces. Look at those faces. They look like they're falling, and mm -hmm. so I'm guessing. Anyway, and then on the bottom, right there, you can see drip drop. So it's very faded. Then what's next? Okay, these are more souvenirs. Here's the bottom. They do have their plugs, and they're uh, horse-drawn horse-drawn wagons uh, that says Arizona. Arizona. And they're, they've got some weight to them. One of them says Arizona, the other doesn't. And they're just cute little silver salt and pepper shakers. That's the top. Well, we have a lot of, who apparently, whoever owned this box. Um, Had a lot of souvenirs. Yes, they, they, they traveled the world. Niagara Falls. Ooh. So these are brass. Now, I'm going to assume, oh, so the top screws off. There we go. On both of them, the top screws off because I looked at the bottom and there wasn't anything and I thought, well, now how do you fill them up? But <laughs> that's how. So this is the bottom. This is the bottom. They both say Niagara Falls and they have these cute little flowers on them. And then this is their spouts. So there we go. Now this one is interesting. It's, I like it, honestly. Yes, this is a camel, guys. <laughs> and on this side is their salt and it hangs on his little saddle. So the saddle bag says Japan. And they ha it hangs on a little hook on the saddle. And this one also says Japan. Yeah. So I have never seen this camel before. He's got he's he's happy to be carrying his salt and peppers too. <laughs> Look at that when, face. When I was looking in the box, which ones I should grab next? I was like, Yeah. It's just a camel. Here's his behind. That is really cute. I've never seen anything like that before. Next we have a gold. This says, whoa, ah, it's okay. It says made in Japan right there. It's a little platter with a tea set that says New Mexico. So this is another souvenir piece. That's cute. And it's gold. Next we have, okay, so 
that cork is pushed up in there and this one has just got a piece of tape over it. And these are pears, I'm assuming. They've been through a lot. He's got a little chip right there. This is the top. But those are really cute. Very old, you can tell just by looking at it. Okay. I don't know if that goes with the I don't think that does. I'm assuming that let's let's hold off on that because I'm not sure that that goes. Yeah. Okay. Here we have this says Idaho, the sportsman's paradise, admitted as state in 1890. Cheers. Ooh. So there's the top. It's got a fish on it. And then the bottom does say Victoria Ceramics made in Japan. So they both have stoppers and they both have their little tags that say that they were made in Japan. And they're cute little chairs. Oh, okay. Take it off. Okay. So next we have this is Inesco Japan, and it says, okay. So it's Inesco. It has a stamp that says Inesco, and it has the tag that says Inesco. Same thing on the cheese. So this is. It reminds me of Tom and Jerry. Only Tom's not a part of this. I know, yeah, yeah. So looky there, there's his. So we've got a little mouse and his wedge of cheese. That's really cute, really cute. Okay, next we have, oh, that's broken. Yeah. Well, we can, we, at, we can at least show them. Well, I'll show you. It was turtles that hugged, but it's got a broken leg, so. That's disappointing. Very disappointing. Because I, I, I just like things that hug. Like, yeah. It just matches. I don't know. This is BP Imports Jap or Import Project Products Japan. They both have stickers. They don't have... Um, Does that say Colorado on it? Yes. And these are just souvenir Colorado salt and peppers. I like that. Yeah. Does that go on anything? Nope. Okay. These are interesting. So you, well, I was going to say you twist them to open them. They look like they twist. See if you can get it open. My, my poor finger is just screaming. Oh, I don't think I can open it because it looks like it's connected right there. Oh, okay. Connected. Then I'm not quite sure. Part of me feels like this is not a complete set. If you've seen this before and you know that it sits on something or something, let me know. But, and I, they do have little plugs on the bottom. I can't imagine trying to get your salt and pepper in there. But there they are. They're tiny, tiny, tiny. Then we have some mushrooms that both say they both say Japan on the bottom. You don't think these go in that? Nope. Well, this is a cactus. Um, so they're orange. They don't have their stoppers. They're orange. They kind of fade to yellow. There's the tops. I like mushrooms. Those are really cute. Very mid-century. These are. Then we have, ooh, these are kind of heavy. These say made in Japan on the bottom and they have their stoppers. Once again, another souvenir piece, Idaho. And on the back, get my fingers out of the way, Idaho. And they are, they are metal. <laughs> I'm trying to see what it says. Something Valley Indian Reservoir. Oh, it's it's all the different things that's in Idaho, I guess. I've never been to Idaho, so there we go. <laughs> but that's really cute in the shape of the state. Okay, these these are cute. These are old. Mm -hmm. So they have their stoppers and they I have they, hugged, they have their marks that say Japan. And looky there. 
their little brother chicks. And sister. Brother and sister. They have their holes on the top. They're sitting, enjoying the day on their chairs. Those are really cute. Those will be great for Easter. Okay. Do these go together? Oh, I found the piece. It does. The, those does. Oh, oh my goodness. Yay, yay, yay. Okay, so this is the Gem State. It's another Idaho piece. It does say made in Japan. And that's what these little salt and pepper shakers sit on. It. There we go. It was under a bunch of salt and pepper shakers. Yeah, I really thought that there was more to that. So there we go. Now. Complete set. Complete set. So here, I don't know if that goes with it or not. I don't know, but it looks like it does. Yeah. We have, well, well would you say cactus? Would you say watermelon? Uh -oh. Would you say can, uh, cucumber? Well, if that go goes with it, I would think it's a cactus. Doesn't it have any markings. It does not have plugs. No plugs. And so what I'm wondering if it goes to is this, because see, it all kind of seems to go together. This has, it, this does have, it's a little picture. It does have a little nick right there. And it says White City, Carlsbad Caverns, New Mexico. It doesn't have a, and this is, this has got some weight to it. This little, this little thing right here. It's a little, I don't know, will you put sugar in it maybe? Anyway. So we've got those. We have. Then we have Las Vegas, Nevada souvenir steins. It says Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. On the bottom, it does say made in Japan. And they both have plugs, and that's good. And they both have their made in Japan stickers. They both have their plugs. Good, good, good. And then here's the back. And they look like beer cans. Yeah, they're signs. Oh, okay. And then something to go with that, lottery machines. Lottery machines. Now, this does not have... Is this lottery? Yes, lottery machine. Okay. Because it has a crank. It has the... Oh, yep. I see. Yeah. So, we've got some little lottery machines here. They don't have... have plugs. Yeah, and they don't say Las Vegas, but... I'm assuming that's where they, I well, mean, you know, you, I mean, you I mean, can gamble even elsewhere, you know, it doesn't have to be Las Vegas, but, but those are cute. I just assume, so. Okay. Next we, it's okay, it's not breaking me. <laughs> we have, I'm probably going to butcher this, but it says, Frey. Bonnie, Scotland. Or is it Prey? No? Frey. I assume that's how you pronounce it. Maybe not. Little silver salt and pepper shaker. Salt, salt and pepper shakers. Salt and pepper shakers. So, I'm assuming that, yes, the top screw off. I'm going to fill them up. I found a plug. Yep. That goes one of those. Then we have Wyoming. Oh no! Now these do have crazing. So the pepper says, Boot Hill. Here lies Pepper Tate. Hanged by mistake. He was right. We was wrong. But we strung him up and now he's gone. Wyoming. And then this one says, Boot Hill. Here lies Salty O'Day. Hoss thief, <laughs> a rope, necktie, an old oak tree, and Salty wasn't what he used to be. So, that's pretty cute. And this is Souvenir of Cheyenne, Wyoming. It's got the flowers on the back of the headstones. That's great. Oh, and on the sides, too. I found the leg of the turtle. Yeah, he can be mended. Okay, what else we got? Okay, so, uh, we already did those, okay. Okay, we have some redware. 
Japan, got, got their mark, Japan. Redware Pigs. They have their stoppers, the back. Really cute pigs. Oh, okay. Then we have some, this is, oh, these actually say Occupy Japan, which we know that's really old. Occupy Japan, they both have their stoppers, and we've got one a man playing an instrument and a man not a man a woman are you sure yeah because the skirt you see well i mean i don't remember i don't know i think it's two men but it maybe it is a man and a woman there you go salt and pepper shakers. i think that's the bagpipe that he's playing i don't know if this goes with those two but I don't have the other, there's nothing that goes else with it. Okay, it probably does not go. Okay. This is a set of, oh, we've got a lady and her little baby and the chief. This was a souvenir for something. It says lake something, but it's off. And it also says MPI 1947 on the back. Both of them say 1947. And they're salt and pepper shakers. Cute. Okay, now we have some. These were made in Japan. So, salt and pepper, little... Dutch boy and girls, maybe. Top and, and well, the tops. Yes, the tops screw off, so that's how you feel them since there's no. So that's cute. This one has the plug stuck in it. Okay, we've got some eggplants, the both marked Japan. The plug is in it. You were correct. Really cute, little. Plants. Okay, what else we got? Okay, we've got two chickens. This is fine quality Lego Japan. They have both have their stickers right there, and we've got a bells there. Bells. Oh, we've got salt and pepper. I was trying to see if one was a rooster. And one was a hen, but they kind of both look the same. Except one has salt and one has pepper. Right, except one has salt and one has pepper. So there they go. There you go. They are ceramic. They look wood, but they are ceramic. That's cute. Then we have... They have salt and pepper in them. Um, I figured that out because I spilled it. Uh oh. What does that say? Mm -hmm. Venus... Point New York. New York. It's the bottom. Tops. Wooden salt and pepper shakers. Oh my goodness. So this is a place that we're very familiar with. We've got some pine cones that say Estes Park. And that's Estes Park, Colorado. That is, uh, we have family there. We have a family condo there. That's where my late husband is buried. And so, if you've never been to Estes, you're missing out. But those are really cute. Okay. And we have some pink glass with strawberries. Strawberries, we've got a lot of stuff with strawberries. Uh, salt. Now, these are really big and they're heavy. And you could almost use them. That's that one. That one's lid looks like somebody tried to make it make the holes bigger. Probably because they were putting like something else. Other but than salt and and, and unfortunately, it's very. It's a and I say it's pink. It's almost like a peach. Yeah. Glass salt and pepper shakers, or I don't know that I wouldn't put something else in them. But I mean, you would think you would put like something other than I don't mm -hmm. know what. Then we have Pepsi Cola, glass, 
the the uh, tops are the tops are plastic and they pop off. And it says Pepsi Pepsi Cola. There's the tops. Um, Grand Canyon, Arizona. These are. I don't know that I don't know whether I know what they are. That's the bottom. I don't think that they would be lanterns. I'm not sure. Well, if it, they were clear, I would think they would be lanterns. Right, you would think that they would. Then we have pantry pops. Granny's turned on glassware. This says. Pepper. This one's salt, but it's, it's the, the oh the sticker. thing. Okay, the sticker's coming off. And no, it came off. Oh, it came off. So we've got salt and pepper. They are glass. This is the bottom of them, and the tops unscrew. The tops are just a little like this is pink, and the top. I mean, the bottle part is red, and the glass, the lids are pink, which is interesting. Like a pink. And I'm sure that could easily be glued back on. That's interesting. Interesting. And then. That's it. Okay. Now I'm going to show you what I think is. Well, I don't think. I know. There's no way that this goes together. But. Oh, well, but we don't have anything. There's nothing up under that. No. Not that I know of. Yeah. No. Okay. So we have this salt and pepper. We do not think the fish. The fish, I am sure, do not go in this. The, the fish are ro those rocking fish, and I know that they don't go in this. This says T.T. T. Patent. Oh, there you go. So, yeah. I'm guessing flowers went in that. Like, so, yeah, something else went in that. Um, so, that's kind of a bummer that that, that doesn't go... Um, so that's it? Mm -hmm. Okay. So that was our salt and pepper haul that we found out of our storage. So we hope y'all enjoy. We are, I have gotten some comments that, uh, you're ready for a sale and we're, we're, work, yeah, we're, we're working to get on prepared for it. Right. We're working on that. And, um, once we do, we'll put up a notification to let you know what day and time and all that. And so I hope you enjoyed this. Please consider like, like, commenting, and subscribing if you haven't already. And um, we will see y'all probably on Thursday. So thank you for watching. You want to say bye? Bye. I don't know. <laughs>